And we're back! Are you ready? Um, As you we've can see, been... Mario's on the deck, man. Had to take some time for some people to eat some holes. What? Making children cry in the backs of their oh mother's minivans. Well, you know what? His mother should watch the games he played. Okay. It's called Eye Hole for Christ's sake. Why would you let your child play something called Eye Hole? And it's a big thing. <laughs> anyway. So, where are we at now? So, so we're right now, still. Okay, so what is the. Why are we still. Why are we fighting these, like, random raiding rabbits? We're trying to. We're trying like, are we collecting to, rabbits? Or are no, they just in happening? our way? They're in our way. We're trying to get to the source of the, the problem. But more stuff keeps popping up on top of that. Because so far. There hasn't been any real context in my perspective as far as like us and the encounters with these rabbits. Like these rabbits just seem to kind of be in these areas and it's almost like tribes in the sense that like we're going from one area and they kind of go yeah. into another person's like territory and they're just like, hey, what are you doing in our territory? And now we, now we fight. <coughs> See, I think that the, the game developers could have created a more sense of uh, urgency and rushing if they made you play through all the characters in front of you. you get that very kind of left for dead, like, yeah. like, wait, go close the door! Go close the door, wait, I'm right here! So if the pipes create the premise that they're like a mouth with teeth and tongue, mm -hmm. do you think it's moist on the inside? I hope not. <laughs> if that's the case, they would have like a little spit emoji thing coming out, and that would be really gross. What? The only emoji that I've seen so far is happy face. I mean, not spit. I've been I, calling happy face. Not a spit emoji, but like they'll have spit come out of the other uh, pipe. It is nice. Vital that we stop that rabbit who integrated himself with the Sabamaj before he creates any more atrocities. Atrocities. Yay! Uh, ugh! I received another message from our best therapist. Let me read it to you. <laughs> Congratulations, people. Congratulations, people. You successfully led your party through trials and... Wait. Trials and... Tri Travels. Oh my god. <laughs> I know. You have to be careful with this. Tri tri travels. Is that even a word? No. Worthy of a decision shout. <laughs> Finally, someone gives me the credit <laughs> I do. Mario sarcastic is sarcastic class. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> well, of course, may you devour your rabbit friend. <laughs> Which scaly battle you vastly underestimated? Yay! <laughs> he underestimated <laughs> us. <laughs> yes, well. No, as you will dizzy. Wait. Though, as with Odysseus, there are brothel waters ahead. Therefore, I feel the time has come to bestow upon you some new tools for your arsenal. <laughs> yes. Yes. Henceforth, in addition, in addition to being able to move the time. <laughs> Fire upon your adversary. You will uh, each be able to perform one other action during the natural course of combat. Yeah. Mario. Oh, Jeeves! Jeeves! Jeeves, come over here! <laughs> to Mario, I have given the gift of Hero Sight. When activated, he will be able Strike at foes within range, even outside the normal succession of events. <laughs> and to the coward, I mean, to the rabid peach, I give the gift of Sion. When used, it will ward against most weapons. 
To Rabbit Luigi, I grant superior second place. No matter what you do, you will always <laughs> play second to your. Is Mario supposed to be younger or older than Luigi? I think Luigi is the younger brother. It protects against enemy super effects and can also reduce damage. Oh, I also got a bubble. <laughs> Alright, Chief, move out of the way. As for how to most effectively use your new gifts, I leave that to you to discover for yourselves. More gifts will come in the future. More I gifts hope. will come in the future. I hope. With anticipation, your biggest fan. Uh -uh. You call your biggest fan Dorothy. Ah, our incognito ally's ability to give us exactly what we need at exactly the right time is uncanny. Remind me not to play them at Go Fish. I think the only game more frustrating than Go Fish is. No. <laughs> it's just the scream. The blah blaster. The blah blaster blaster. Red wasp blaster. Retro blaster. But not if you say it like this. Turbine. The suspicious covers. They have some super effects in here. Most of this stuff. Do they? They look ready to explode or something. Let's avoid using weapons. Or, let me have ranged weapons. Their faces pressed against those boxes. What the heck is that? Italy. <laughs> There's a block that looks like it has like a fake looking thing. Yeah, right there. Right there. See, it's like a weird like high heel version of Italy. Right there. Oh, you talking about this right here? Yeah. I see what you mean now. Yeah, look at that. Reusing reusing models. I see you, Nintendo. I make cuts, shortcuts like that, too. <laughs> Whoa! He just... Was that because he ran out of HP or because he was knocked off of the... Uh, when you get knocked off, that's also extra HP. It's not instant death? No, it's not instant death. So how do you come back onto the course? You teleport back on it. You have to go. MLG Pro. Yes, he has springs on his feet, and yet we've yet to see him really utilize those. Well, that's because he doesn't really utilize them until uh, he has another partner inside. Hello! Bye! Alright! Wow. That is like special ability that he got from the wizard wall. Where are you going? Now the question is, did I shoot six bullets or five? Because frankly, I've lost count myself! So the real question is... How do you feel like a hmm? Do you? you? Do you? <laughs> See, Luigi's mouth, or the rabbit Luigi, looks kind of more like Barney Gumble. 
<laughs> my hat? <laughs> or no, uh, Lenny. A little bit. Right. Also, speaking of Lenny, I believe in my head. I always related the weird little skinny pencil character mm -hmm. next in um, the, the skinny pencil lumberjack in Fern Gully as a very humanized, non-Simpson-esque Lenny. and praise all these weird little anime things and you can't even bother yourself to immerse yourself in an American cartoon classic. <laughs> He's just like, what? Huh? You call that a gunshot? I'll show you gunshots. Come over here, blindy. Little does he know. There's another You're just playing pinball. Which billiards. Are they respawning in this encounter as well? No. You know, this game reminds me a lot less of like a tactics like XCOM or Final Fantasy Tactics, but it reminds me a lot more of like what laser tag would be if it was a turn-based video game. Because it doesn't seem to really be like high stakes, like, oh, you know, you can get a chance of like, oh, I got a melee again, or you could like so, yeah, cast you down have, like range areas. You still so. have more attack powers that you haven't gotten yet. So far. <laughs> Because, like, the NPCs don't really seem to be very concerned about their health. Exactly. Like, they're not really frustrated. Like, oh no, my, my weird person's been hurt. for like 25. Curve? <laughs> Learning curve? What is that? I remember playing that and then like, what, I can't remember what level it was. I just remember I got like... All I remember is it was like a bunch of powers and then that's when the game decided to be like, Oh, by the way, here's a steep learning curve, so have fun with this. I can't go back to level up all my characters, this is BS. Some green. Okay. That honey is gross. And honey's not supposed to go gross. It's supposed to last for as long as the Egyptians existed. <laughs> well, you know, rabbit honey is different. It's gross. It's probably for like peanut butter or something. Yeah. Saying rabbit honey makes me think that's going to squeeze a rabbit. Look at that death metal duck. Which sounds like a Darkwing Duck. It does. Like sidekick or villain. It's like... It's definitely good. Aha! Ha, Darkwing Duck! I said you meet again! Yeah, Darkwing Duck. It's like, who are you? It's like, I'm Death Metal Duck! BOOM! Oh, God, I hate this. But the thing is, would Death Metal Duck be a pun villain? Or would he just be like a Bane type person where he's just like, I'm going to kill you now? I think he would be a pun. That's, that's the way Do you 
think a punk rocker would make puns though? Like I could see him making puns because I'm kind of. I'm resisting the urge to make punk death metal duck go into pun mode. But would a punk rocker make puns? Maybe he would, but they just wouldn't be that great. Yeah. I mean, I would be punk rocker. Or make not great puns. <laughs> so, death metal people out there, if you disagree, please feel free to comment to comment below. <laughs> The sooner you get out of this maze, the sooner we can go on to the next episode. I don't know how that sentence actually goes. Dragon Ball Z! I am not doing this quite right now. Is it even necessary? Do you need to do it to progress the point thing? No, it just unlocks weapons. Oh, is that it? And we'll go to level 5 on the next episode!